Hey YouTube, this next review will be on the 2019 Ford GT, the 24 Hours of the Mall, number 67 Ford GT, paying tribute to the late A.J. Foyt and Dan Gurney in the 1967 Le Mans 24 Hours. This is a really cool looking Spark model I picked up from Bur not Burbank House of Hobbies, this is one from uh, Replicars. Picked this up from my buddies over at Replicars. This is a very cool looking 4 GT. I will probably get the entire set of 4 GTs from the 24 Hours of the Mall this year. I know the 66 one is out right now. The 68 and 69 are to be released at the current moment. So I'll be waiting on those. But this is a pretty cool looking spark model for the 67 Ford GT, I must say. It comes in the standard packaging for the 24 Hours of the Mall. Not like the... Um, the, the mall winter we just reviewed recently, but this one has a blue blue color design. It's got multicolor shades of blue on it, kind of like a sky kind of blue or kind of a really blurred out photo, which kind of makes it for a really nice effect here. Got the Dunlop Bridge. Well, can't put Dunlop there on the on the markings there, but it's Dunlop Bridge back here. Twenty four hours of the mall. Got the Ford GT Spark SparkModel.com. Got Spark twenty nineteen. And, of course, this is a GT Pro car, which is number 67, Spark, and all the copyright stuff on the bottom here. So let's take the stuck around here. You know, this was, this was the one of the top priority ones to get. I mean, the 68 Ford GT is going to be absolutely outstanding. I mean, that's going to be an absolutely incredible livery to review. That's going to be paying tribute to the 2016 Le Mans winner. But this one's paying tribute to... to um, Went from Jig in 1967 with four with uh, AJ and Dan Gurney driving the wheel. So that's gonna be this is gonna be a really interesting car to review here. Let's let's see if we open this up. Sorry, I never took a tape out of this thing, so bear with me here. I'm gonna untape this and take this sucker out. So let's see here. Oh, this thing's a beaut here. This thing's a this thing's gorgeous. Wait till I show this on camera. This thing's an absolute beautiful die cast. Well, not die cast. This is a resin model. It's not die cast, technically. But here we go. Here she is right in front of you. And, it come, and, of course, all Spark models come in its own little plastic case. Let's do a nice little 360 view of it inside the casing here. There she goes. Why do I feel something's missing here? Am I on drugs? Yeah, I'm on drugs. <laughs> I thought something was missing there. I was like, wait a minute, is something missing there? Nope. This is me being on drugs. So there she is, all in its glory. There you have it, the 67 Ford GT, ready to review here. Absolutely outstanding Spark model here. I mean, I, I got to give Spark a lot of credit for this one. I mean, I know I kind of gave him a little crap on Instagram last night about the uh, number 10 Wayne Taylor Cadillac for having decal misplacements which I'll go over on that review but um overall that makes such nice quality products and you know this is just an absolutely outstanding product here as well here we go we got Ford EcoBoost got Castel Edge I like how it has the little toe uh, hook there I don't know if you can see it maybe the camera's a little too bright there let's see if we try to maybe shine a little bit of light on that one but there's a there's the little toe thingy right there where you can tow it back to the paddock area on this side, we have Michelin. We got Ford Chip Ganassi Racing logo. Got Michelin tires. This thing's even decaled enough to where you, have, you see the brake pads and the brake rotors. Absolutely beautiful. Got number 67 WC GTE Pro with the three three headlights. Not three headlights, excuse me. The three lights that determine the position they're in. 24 hours total. Ford Eco Boo. Boo! You stink! <laughs> it's just kidding. Of course, EcoBoost is hidden by the little air, the little air bits here. That's pretty cool. Let's see here. Got Harry Ticknell, Andy Prio, and Jonathan Bomberito as the drivers of this car. Here we go. We got Pro. 24 hours total. American flag. 67. Got the latches there to open the hood. Got Ford, Ford Performance. Absolutely beautiful here. Beautiful, beautiful car. Sparco. Trying to read what that says. 
DSSY, Brembo, Exalta, FIA, Action and Safety, whatever the heck that is, Castro Edge, Michelin, got the Michelin Man, look how that, look how that little Michelin Man running, aw, he's having a grand old time, GT, Ford Power by EcoBoost, Ford Chip Ganassi Racing, on the back, oh, that's, that's a mean looking back bumper, I love the diffusers on this damn thing, got the Ford EcoBoost, Ford, 67 GT, four power by EcoBoost. And I believe that's a little paint chip by where the Ford EcoBoost logo is. Yep, oh, that's this that's decal misplacement there. Oh, I don't want to touch that again. And this side's the same as the left. What an absolute beauty of a spark model this is. Just oh my god, they did such an amazing job with this with this sucker here. Beautiful job. But anyways. You know, if I had to give it a rating, you know, it almost gets a perfect 10. Beautiful tribute to AJ, beautiful tribute to Dan Gurney. Love those guys, and I absolutely love this car. What an absolute outstanding looking car. Just wish that damn, those damn Ford decals, man. Whew. Thank God it's in, thank God it's in a uh, case there. Otherwise, that would have been shown. Oh, well. Here we go. What's the front bumper is all colored white. They got a white stripe going right above the Ford logo. And it kind of shoots out towards the 67 where it kind of stops at the 67. Or maybe it continues. It's just blocked by a bunch of lettering there. Uh, got another white stripe coming from the headlights. That white stripe continues all the way to the driver's door. Then the white stripe starts at the door. Goes right above the air flake here where we want to call this little sucker here. And it goes right towards the driver's roof. Right towards the roof of the car. Got carbon fiber pieces on where the side skirts are. Back bumper where the diffuser is. And that's going to be all. That's going to have a strip of white on it. And it's going to have strips outlined in red, outlined in white. Same with the engine cover, too. The engine cover's got that as well. And the side, same as the left. So in all reality, this is a really cool looking Spark model here. Absolutely highly recommended. I would probably say though the 68 is probably the bit of one that's where it's going to be really going to be the one for me to get. That's, that's going to be where I'm going to be like, alright, just shut up and take my money. What an absolute beauty here. Here's 360 view of it. Here's the right side. Here's the back of the car. And that's about it. Beautiful looking spark model. I absolutely just love this thing. Comment, like, and subscribe. And this is Race Day 21 reminding you to join the fight to stop bullying. It does get better. The diecast kid is always happy to see you.